Oh, have you ever wondered how fermentation works? Well, it's a process as old as time itself playing a vital role in our culinary history. This magical transformation turns simple everyday ingredients into extraordinary foods and beverages. From the humble loaf of bread to the tangy bite of cheese, the refreshing sip of beer to the complex flavors of kimchi, sauerkraut and kombucha, fermentation is the silent artist behind it all. But what exactly is it? At its core, fermentation is a natural process where bacteria and yeasts break down sugars. It's a dance of microscopic life, creating culinary masterpieces in its wake. The result? A symphony of flavors that adds depth and character to our meals. But the magic of fermentation extends far beyond our taste buds. So let's delve into the fascinating world of fermentation. Fermentation at its core is a biochemical process. Now that might sound a bit intimidating, but let's break it down into simpler terms. What we're really talking about here is transformation. It's like a magic trick that nature pulls off, turning one thing into something entirely different and often more beneficial. You see, fermentation involves the conversion of sugars into alcohol or acids. This isn't done by some complex machinery or high-tech gadget. No, it's done by the smallest of life forms, microorganisms. They work under anaerobic conditions, which essentially means they don't need oxygen to do their job. Let's delve a little deeper into this process. Imagine you're a microorganism, a yeast or a bacteria. You come across some sugar. It could be in a grape, a cabbage leaf or a tea leaf. What do you do? You eat it. But unlike us, these microorganisms don't have a digestive system to process the sugar. So they ferment it, they break down the sugar converting it into simpler substances. If you're a yeast, you'll produce alcohol and carbon dioxide. If you're a bacteria, you'll likely produce an acid. This process not only changes the food or drink on a chemical level, but it also alters its taste, texture and smell. The tanginess of sauerkraut, the fizziness of kombucha, the unique flavor of wine, all these are the result of fermentation. Even the dough for our beloved bread undergoes fermentation, which gives it that characteristic fluffy texture. But the magic doesn't stop there. This process also increases the shelf life of many foods. Remember, fermentation was a preservation method long before refrigeration came into the picture. So the next time you enjoy a slice of sourdough or a sip of wine, remember the invisible army of microorganisms that work tirelessly to create these culinary delights. In essence, these tiny microorganisms are the real heroes in the fermentation process. Now you might be wondering where all this fermentation is happening. This age-old process of fermentation is abundant in our everyday foods. Let's take a stroll through your kitchen, shall we? You might be surprised by how many fermented foods you can find. First stop, the pantry. That loaf of bread sitting there. It owes its fluffy texture to yeast, a microorganism that ferments the sugars in dough, producing carbon dioxide and causing the dough to rise. Next, we find ourselves in the refrigerator, eyeing a bottle of beer. The effervescence and alcohol in beer is the handiwork of yeast again, fermenting the sugars in the barley. And who can forget cheese? In the cheese-making process, bacteria ferments lactose, the sugar in milk, into lactic acid. This acid curdles the milk, and voila, we have cheese. Now let's venture to the more exotic realm of fermented foods. Kimchi, a staple in Korean cuisine, is made by fermenting cabbage with lactic acid bacteria. The result? A tangy, spicy and crunchy delight. Sauerkraut, a beloved side dish in Germany, is another example. It's simply cabbage fermented with lactic acid bacteria, similar to kimchi but with a different set of seasonings. Finally, we have kombucha, a fizzy and tangy beverage gaining popularity worldwide. It's made by fermenting sweetened tea with a symbiotic culture of bacteria and yeast, also known as a SCOBY. This fermentation process not only adds a unique flavor, but also produces a variety of beneficial compounds. So you see, fermentation is a culinary magician, transforming ordinary ingredients into delicious and diverse delicacies. It's a process that's been honed over centuries, adding depth and complexity to our foods. And it's happening right under our noses, in our kitchens. Indeed, without fermentation, our diets would look very different. Fermentation isn't just about creating delicious foods and drinks. It's a process that brings a plethora of health benefits to our tables, making it more than just a culinary marvel. It's also a health wonder. 
One of the key benefits of fermented foods is their richness in probiotics. These are live microorganisms, often referred to as good bacteria. They are known to promote a healthy balance of gut bacteria and have been linked to a wide range of health benefits. They can improve digestive health, reduce depression, promote heart health and even help with weight loss. Yes, you heard it right, that tangy sauerkraut or that effervescent kombucha you enjoy isn't just tantalizing your taste buds, it's also aiding your health in more ways than one. Beyond probiotics, fermentation can also increase the nutritional value of food. This process can help to break down nutrients in food, making them more easily digestible. For instance, the fermentation process in sourdough bread helps to break down phytic acid, allowing your body to absorb more minerals from the bread. Similarly, in soybeans, fermentation breaks down proteins into amino acids, making them easier for your body to utilize. So, next time you enjoy a serving of kimchi, remember you're not just indulging in a spicy, flavorful treat. You're also nourishing your body with an array of health benefits. So, not only does fermentation make food taste better, it also makes it healthier. In conclusion, the science of fermentation is truly fascinating. This ancient process, used in foods like kimchi, sauerkraut and kombucha, is not only a culinary wonder but also a boon to our health. It aids digestion, boosts immunity, and enriches the flavors of our meals. The magic of fermentation is all around us, transforming our food and enhancing our lives in unexpected ways. Next time you enjoy your favorite fermented food or drink, remember the magical process and the tiny heroes that made it possible.